on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. I am so sorry. Mom, it's not your fault. No, it is. I... I just can't tell you why. It's too dangerous. Mom, don't... Do you have to blame yourself for my reason not having a quirk? Seriously, it's just... One of those things that happens sometimes. But you should have a quirk. Maybe I could teach him magic, but mm, they'll be more suspicious. Okay, um, you know what? You can still be a hero. You're just going to train or whatnot, all right? Uh huh? Yeah, just. Mm, you, you're just gonna have to train harder than most when it comes to, you know, quirk capable people. It's just gonna be a little bit more difficult. I can take you to take some martial arts classes or we can work on you getting some support gear. It's gonna be great. Really? Of course. As yes, this is Izuku's real childhood, because all things you see are... Yeah, he was diagnosed quirkless. But this time, Inko apologizing makes a lot more sense. Because the race of alien that she actually is... Yeah, guys, they're, they're really female. Or at least have more feminine characteristics. So, <laughs> yeah, it's like I would try to pass on the spark to you, but for some reason, and she, yeah, no, no, it doesn't really work that way. So, <laughs> my cousin Azashi, he's pretty much like, I'm out. Just like that, one picture, that's it. It's like, yeah. <sighs> So how my god he better actually be working. What was that? Nothing. <clears throat> so, uh, what do you want to do today? Um, I I already know. Uh, really, I want to check out more Eraserhead videos. Really? Huh. Yeah, that's right. You. You have much for All my anymore, are you? N no, it's not that. I still like him. It's just. Him compared to others who don't have strength based quirks? I found that more respectable considering that they use their skills instead of their just relying on mainly quirks like Razorhead is essentially quirkless like and he makes other people quirkless so they have no choice but to fight on his uh, terms so to speak not to mention heck if he does end up going up against quirkless criminals there's no need for him to use his quirk and okay I get it I get it <sighs> but at the very least, I'm happy that you're happy. And remember, I can heal you. You just have to be careful on how bad you get hurt. Uh, oh, come on. I, I know how to be careful. 
The whole time when you broke your arm messing with nunchucks. Uh, well, that's different. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you say. At the very least, as long as you're careful, I'm fine with it. Great. Thanks, Mom. Yep. <sighs> if only you were a girl. What? <clears throat> Nothing. It's just like, wait, did you pref would you have preferred if I was? No, that's not what I'm saying. I'm um, where I'm from. It's mainly girls who awaken quirks. Let's just say that. Also, it, it does have a. I'm quirkless because of my gender. Uh, I. There was always a 50 50 chance, but. Oh. So it is my fault. No, no, I, I, I did not say that. That's not why I said. It's just. Uh, you never know what what hand you're gonna be dealt. That that's all. Oh, okay. As in the hair crash, Izuku, him listening, like, also oh, hero fight. Can we go see? I don't know. That's kind of dangerous. Please. Uh. Uh. Not fine, fine, fine. Okay, just promise that you, if anything goes south, you will will leave. I swear. <sighs> okay, fine. Let's go. As soon as they see Izuku's looking, and it's All Might versus All for One, them pretty much going out like. You could say they are literally fighting for their lives. All Might especially, because Izuku's never seen an All Might video where he went this ballistic. Once All Might gets hurt, something snaps within Izuku, and this is when Inko notices something terrifying. A scary realization as Izuku's hair starts flashing, his eyes start to slowly disappear it starts glow glowing more purple it's like wait what's going on as she goes to reach out for Izuku's hand he's just walking up to All Might who's down for the count Izuku? He's not saying anything. He's, he's, Inko in her mind is like, "This is this is not possible. This is impossible. How is this happening?" He's a guy. That's not my. The doctor said. As Izuku just places his hand on All Might, closing the wound and fixing his respiratory system, as awful one looking at this. You, <clears throat> boy, heal me too. Izuku, just staring at all for one, lifts up his hand and points a finger. What's that supposed to? As a death beam just pierces through all for one's chest, as he falls. Izuku. As yes, this is when he passes out. All Might, at full strength, he's shocked. Like, what just happened? As Inko is pretty much pushing him out of the way and shaking Izuku away, trying to make sure he's alright because, yeah, she don't give a damn about All Might. Are you serious? No, she doesn't care. <laughs> that's her son. That's unconscious.
Serious? You, you don't remember anything? No. Uh, I, why, why are you crying? I was worried you... Something happened. And where is this? When a doctor shows up, it's like, yes, it seems as though your son, despite being diagnosed quirkless, does have a quirk. What? Indeed. I, I... No way, I... My quirk? Inko looking... This is not possible. That's impossible. What do you mean? You should not have that quirk. I mean, at least this power. What? This... This is the abilities that I told you about the only manifest within females of my, where I'm from. So, forgive me if this is still somewhat hard for me to believe. Uh, oh, wait, does that mean I'm him just lifting his pants? Uh, like, no, it's still there. I, I am, I'm a guy. I, I know you are. That's, I'm just a little taken aback by it. It's just, wow. Well, at the very least, uh, I know I can definitely be a hero now. Yeah. But you are gonna have to uh, undergo a lot of training. Uh, really? Yes, and it's gonna be a lot more difficult than what I had you doing before. So are you prepared to do so? Yes. Good. I can't believe this is happening. I, all I can do is hope no one finds out. <sighs> Ex excuse me. Hmm? Ah, oh, it's you. The reason my son awakened to quirk. Or the reason why he's gonna have a target on his back. Uh, I... Apologize, Miss Midoriya. This is my son, Izuku. Well, young Midoriya, I would like to thank you wholeheartedly for what you did. Huh? You saved me. I did not know you had a healing quirk. Uh, I didn't know either, I just, I, it just felt right. Your body moved on its own. We over, were overcome with emotions. Believe me, it happens to all heroes. <sighs> really? Well, at least the natural born ones. The good ones. Even I've suffered from that. Huh. So, you think I can become a great hero? There's no doubt in my mind. As, yeah, Iko sees the happiness in Izuku's face. Well, aren't you just a smooth talker? Excuse me? Nothing. Either way, is that all you want to say? 
because I would like to have my son discharged and take him home so he can begin his training. Well, if you don't mind, I'd like to help him as well. What? Yes, I would like to um, oversee his training as well. There's no need for that. But I, I insist, you don't know a thing about how powerful my son can be. I do. And I may be the only thing that can actually keep him from doing anything disastrous. What? I'll explain everything to you later. Okay? But right now, I'm talking with Mr. Might. Uh, well, uh, <sighs> now, um, thank you for the offer, but there is no need for your assistance. As, yeah, they go home. Izuku's like, wait, well, why'd you act that way to All Might? As... <sighs> well, considering what's going to happen to you, I might as well tell you. We aren't human. Huh? At least I know I'm not. You see, son, we're <sighs> Anodites. A what? We're not from Earth. We're actually, well, um, an alien species from another planet. That's crazy, Mama. I mean, there's no such thing as aliens. Is it? Uh, you're you're not joking, are you? As Inko sheds her human skin, her form that she created is. Uh, what? No, 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 no way. Wait, so that's not what you really look like? Well, no. I chose this body many years ago upon seeing one Nana Shimura. What? She was a hero who went missing. When I came to this world, I decided to, you know, blend in. Little did I know how diverse everyone would look, so... Huh. Hmm. So, are, are you serious? Yeah, we're not he you. I I never expected you to get a well these powers because, like I said, it's usually the f female only to really inherit them. I I mean I think I. I, if anything, I assumed you would develop a quarry, but not these abilities. So, wait, so how powerful... Well... With enough time, experience and such, you would be able to actually... 
what? We can warp reality however we see fit if we get enough power and experience. That's how powerful we are. At least our race is. Uh, what? Think of it like this. We could change the setting of a room to that of a torture chamber or to heaven incarnate. It all depends on what we want. But this is only through enough training. Which I just, which now you can see why I didn't want Mr. Might to interfere. Oh. So. Yeah. Do you want to still be a hero? Do you still want to train? They're going to number one? Yes. Well, then we have a lot of work to do.